go and correct it, man. We correct ourselves. And a lot of you guys, you don't want to even address the thing on the Koneas thing like a priest done your Allah. You asked that many a times a couple of years back, man. And you ignore it, brother. You ignore it, man. Yep. You can't you can't ignore that, man. That's that's part of the scriptures, man. Now you don't want to admit it because you're well, hey, Nate admitted it, man. Because it was in the back of his mind. That's right. Yeah, well, we always say nobody gets more on GMS than we do. We get on ourselves, you know? So anyway, um the Greek word rebuke. Epitimao. And um it says to show honor, to honor, uh, to a judge, uh, to tax with fault, to admonish or charge sharply. And uh, now, El uh, when Elder Tar read about when uh, Paul said to Timothy, "I charge thee," I had looked up the word "charge," and it means to ec an extreme request, like when you charge somebody. You know, back in the ancient world, when you when somebody was brought on charges, that was a very uh, important thing, man. Yeah, another word for charge, I charge you, is you're commanded. You're commanded, commanded. to go out there and speak. Uh, uh, you go out there uh, in season and out of season. Okay. That's right. And so, so you know, that's a cut to you guys. That's not going out there, man. Yeah. Uh, the next word is exhort. Is the Greek Strong's G thirty-eight seventy Parakaleo Parakaleo. It says, to call to one side, call for summon, to admonish, exhort, uh, to encourage, strengthen. All right, so the next word is um, long-suffering. Greek word. Strong's G, 3115, makrathumia, makrathumia. And it says, patience. Does the word patience mean to suffer? Endurance. Now, the scriptures say endure sound doctrine means you got to be hard to deal with the truth. Because when you look that word up, endure, it comes from the word durable, which means hard. When something is durable, that means it's hard. It it takes it can take punishment. You know, it's like a like a like a speed bag or a boxing everlast punching bag. That's durable. You can hit the shit out of it. It just keeps coming back for more. You know, um, patience, endurance, constancy. Now that's a lot of a lot of them different groups are they're guilty of that. They're they're not consistent. They're not consistent. Uh constancy. Yeah, an example of that is um H O D C came out. We we started putting up videos on YouTube in uh July of um oh seven and I believe they started putting up videos sometimes in oh eight. It could have been the end of uh oh seven or the beginning of oh eight, but I remember when they uh they came on the scene and the videos that they put up, there were no videos of them speaking out there on the highways and the byways. Yeah. And that was for a good couple of years. And then, you know, at one time, it popped up. They was out there on the streets. And, uh, I mean, I don't know if they're going to come. Well, knowing them, they're going to deny it. No, we was always out in the streets and all that. That's yeah, bullshit, which is, man. Which is a damn lie. Look, the one thing GMS does, we watch all your videos, man. We check yeah. out all your videos, just like you check out our videos. We check out Nate's videos, your Honda videos. We check out all of them, and they check out our videos, man, to see what new thing has come up, man. We check out all you guys. So you're going to tell me that I'm lying? I ain't lying, man. That's right. There was a point for a couple of years. The first, I think you started going out there maybe mid-2010, mm -hmm. something like that. You start, but, but, but for the first couple of years... All your videos was in a dark room. What I believe was in Menorah was in the in the back a background, man. Yeah, boring, boring as hell too. Those, yep, those videos were boring as hell too. And then like, if you go to their videos right now, they put up a, a new site going back three months. There's no hits on it, man. You go back three months, you might have 22 hits, 13 hits. Yeah, that's why you want to come together with everybody. And then, and then you're going to say, let's come together. Yeah. Well, and we and our response is, we're not going to come together with y'all, man. Because <laughs> a lot of y'all are not of the elect, all right? And Yakanan, he got you good, the latest video he did. Now, on one hand, Barack, you're saying that uh, that this guy, uh, Gehenna, was guilty of trying to murder Mo. There was this murder conspiracy. Now, towards the end of the video, you said that the table, the door is open for Yohanna. 
So that why means would, why would you want to get with a with guy that you know with a murderer? Yeah. Or why would you ask for, to get with Kofi? Kofi is teaching that uh, uh, there's a guy out there's a hell, and there's a guy down there that punch you in the face, mm -hmm. and there's no scriptures on that. Yeah. Then uh, Mary and Joseph never had sex. Come on, man. If you did that, if you bring all these people together, you know, first of all, if I'm if I'm at the meeting, if I do go out the meeting, <laughs> you're gonna hear me, you're gonna hear me out from the uh, the top of my lungs, man. God, and that man. finger's gonna be waving in your there's gonna be fights breaking out and all that, yeah, man. Yeah, that's right. Chairs are gonna be thrown. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> people are gonna start getting up and leave. It'll be cha chaotic, man. That's right. Okay? That's right. It'll be chaotic. Yeah. Could you imagine? Nate being up in there and Comfy being up in there and us being up in there and them being up there. Could you imagine it? Because we we seen the bullshit, man. That's right. There'll be all kind of accusations going back and forth, man. That's right. Yeah. The, the, the yeah, I was just thinking about that. The council all those years are back. You guys showed yourself to be demons. That's why Elder Tar made that statement. This is a high-tech lynching and all you motherfuckers were laughing, man. Yep. You know? Well, them guys didn't know. They See... Barack, Banyamian, and all them, all of them got, all of a sudden, they, they found their boldness and shit. Back then, you, 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 they were quiet as a church church mouses, man. Yeah, yeah. They ain't have a peep about nothing. They ain't even said nothing, man. They just sat back. All right? Yeah, you were never innovators, uh, Ben. You was never an innovator, man. You would never. You wasn't a, never ideas man or get things started. Well, that's an act. What they're doing now is yeah. an act, man. It's a that's all. Act. They, all they're doing is an act, man. You act like we don't hey, know you guys. there was a guys. thing. There was a time where they had a. Uh, uh, oh, when uh, um, uh, uh, Shabazz uh, woman was taken away by the council and given to a uh, lawyer, did Bunyamin, did you stand up with a toothpick in your mouth and say, look, that's <laughs> wrong? Now, if you come back and say, well, did you do it? Yes, I did. I said, that this, that's adultery, man. I, oh. I pulled Lahab. I said, Lahab, that's adultery. All yeah. right? Yeah. There was a point where Lahab had a party set up and he was giving out tickets to people. And then I guess he wasn't selling enough ticket so we had a meeting and he said we're gonna let, or allow Edomites to come to the party man and Mo was Masha was there Shaw was there Yeshia was there Ariel was there Gazak I believe he was there and you guys had to be there maybe, maybe you say well I wasn't there but you know what happened I looked around when he said that mm -hmm. and there was not a peep from nobody man I looked around at Shaw I looked at Yeshia I said Yeshia ain't saying nothing I looked at Mo and Mo was going like this, drinking his coffee or whatever. And I looked at Ariar, and Ariar had a mean look on his face, man. And I said, I said, I said this. I said, I said, Ariar, you. I was sitting right next to Ariar. I said, Ariar, you with this bullshit? He said, Hell no. Mm. And then me and Ariar raised. He said, No, ain't no crackers coming to no party, man. Yeah. And then when me and Ariar said that, that's yeah, that's right. Yeah, we ain't gonna have no Edomites up in up in there. Was you there, man? Did you go to Lahav's parties where they used to ask everybody for $100 to get the place and then have you go to the parties and charge you to go into the parties and charge you for bearing food? And then that was back in um, the late 80s, mm -hmm. early 89 or whatever. I don't know the exact year. And then they realized they would sell Heineken for like $2. Mm -hmm. Then they realized they wanted more money and the price would go up from $2 to $5, man. <laughs> And I remember I didn't wow. go to that party because I said I ain't going to that fucking party, man. Because those guys are demons, man. You know? And here you are drinking and shit. And then you go to get another Heineken. <laughs> and then $5. It's five. Here you gave them $100 to get the place. Yeah. Here you, here you paying to get in. And they're going to charge you $5 for a Heineken. Two hours ago it was $2, man. Because it was all about money, man. Not even the so-called Jew would do that shit. That, that's right, man. <laughs> and he's the devil. But nobody had nothing negative to say about Lahab. Yeah. Nobody ever had nothing to say about that guy, man. But here you guys, you clowns, now all of a sudden you found your voice. Fun, yeah, now all of a sudden you bow. Was you bow back then? Nope. Yeah, we were brought to council. But, uh, we, we were charged, beginning of El Tahar, we were charged with saying that Lahab is the black demon. Well, you know what? We told the truth. <laughs> and we were. And we were that's right why Lahab didn't get mad. Because yeah. he knew. He said, yeah, they found out. Yep. Uh, them, yep. Them cats found out. <laughs> yep. Were you there, Ben? With your toothpick in your mouth? And we didn't back down. It was El yeah, Tahar. Ben, ben you come on, stop faking, man. Yeah, stop faking. Let's man. Stop faking. Like you're some tough guy, man. You ain't no tough guy, man. When you came up to the, to, to the school up there, 
uh, uh, up in Connecticut, you had the toothpick <laughs> in your mouth walking like a ga- fake ga- gangster, man. God. Come on, man. Well, gangster rap was big back then. <laughs> hey, well. Said, Wait a minute. Is that Ben? Yeah. I said Ben. That was Ben last week. <laughs> Where you get that toothpick from? He's a good actor. Hey, hey, it was Elder Tahar, myself, and Elder Ricard. And this guy, Robert Jones, we always talk about him. He got up in the council. He did that temptation spin. And he said, Lahab, you want to hear this? This brother and this brother and this brother, they call Lahab the black demon. They said the sentence.